Right now, a Birmingham police officer and a suspect are recovering from injuries while the Alabama Law Enforcement Agency investigating, investigates what led up to that shooting. CBS 42 News reporter Brittany Bivens has been following this investigation throughout the afternoon and evening for us. She joins us live at the Birmingham Police Headquarters. Brittany, update us on what you've learned tonight. Well, Jim, what we know right now is that there was an officer involved shooting and that there were two people sent to the hospital. One of those was the suspect who had gunshot. At this point, uh, it's difficult to tell what happened. It may just be a completely accidental situation uh, involving the chase. A court and of Georgia Road. Now, now, according to Birmingham police, that did happen at the corner of Joppa Court and Georgia Road around 430 this afternoon. And what we're told by them tonight is that there was some kind of altercation where the suspect, they say, was acting erratically and irrationally. We are told that from there, the Birmingham police officer then approached the suspect. There was some kind of altercation where the police officer gave chase to that suspect. And at some point, we were told they ran into each other. The suspect did have two guns on him. According to Birmingham police, meanwhile, the police officer was also carrying a gun when they bumped into each other. One of those guns discharged right now. They're really trying to figure out exactly which gun that was that went off. And again, right now trying to piece together with the Alabama law enforcement agency. They are now in charge of it. And Brandon Falls district attorney says those findings will be passed on to him. He'll decide what to do from there. Live tonight from Birmingham police headquarters, Brittany Bivens, CBS 42 News.